Frontenac, Lennox, and Addington. Thank you, Speaker. Speaker, tomorrow will mark the 85th anniversary of the repeal of prohibition in Ontario. Thomas Reed once opined that one of the greatest delusions in the world is a hope that the evils in this world are to be cured by legislation. In the difficult years of World War I, members of the temperance movement forgot Mr. Reed's dictum and Ontario banned the sale of alcohol. For eight years between 1916 and 1924, the people of Ontario were prohibited from drinking their favorite beers, wines, and spirits. For eight years, our traditions of individual liberty were squashed and criminal activity flourished in the trade and smuggling of spirits. Indeed, in hindsight, prohibition was an unfortunate era in our history. In 1924, following a referendum, prohibition was replaced with our current system of dealing with alcohol. Today, people across Ontario have a lackluster choice in alcohol for purchase. Today, our citizens pay exorbitant taxes and inflated costs to prop up government-protected monopolies that deny consumers choice. And though our, 19, though our 1924 referendum was a step in the right direction, Order. for it repealed the failed eight-year experiment with prohibition Order. by empowering people through referendums, this government has fallen back into the failures of a nanny state once again. <laughs> Member statements.